there are people in our lives that are just there for a season. And once that season is over, we have to let go as well. Hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I am here again for another Coffee with C. I'm currently on a business trip. This is not my home. I'm on a hotel. So please don't mind that painting because I don't have anything to do with it. I wanted to share with you guys one of the principles that I live by. This principle is very powerful to me because I've been through it. Go where you are celebrated. Don't stay where you are tolerated. What do I mean? When I was younger, I didn't know much back then. I would do whatever it takes for me to be accepted by people that I truly care about. When I say people, this could be your partner, your friends, your family, or your relatives. Unfortunately, in my case, there were relatives. And that made it harder for me to walk away. The thing is, we do not choose our family members. I think what I have been through in the past, I have tried my best. They are my family. My relatives mean a lot to me. The thing is, what I have learned, there are people in our lives that are just there for a season. And we have to accept that fact. And once that season is over, we have to let go as well. You don't have grudges against them or you don't have any bad feelings against them. You just have to maintain distance, love and pray for them from a distance. Because if you don't, they will suck the energy out of you. And life is too short to spend time with people that really do not want you to be around. It sucks because for me, they were relatives. It's not a friend or strangers that I can just easily walk away from. As I have become more matured, I told myself everyone deserves to be in a place where they are celebrated, not in the place that they are tolerated and that as soon as they leave that place, they are being talked about. It took me a very long time to accept that fact. I worried a lot about what my relatives would think. But the thing is, Regardless of what I would do, it's not going to change. They would say something. It just came to a point that I have to learn the hard way. This is a battle that I could never win because them not liking or accepting me, that is a choice that they have already made. Whatever I would do, even if I would take a bullet for them, that wouldn't change or that wouldn't be appreciated. Or maybe it, if it would, then I'm already dead. That's unfortunate. And the thing is, these are just people who are not meant to be in your life. And I am not saying that you should be mad at them. You should uh, have grudge against them. Maintain your distance intentionally in such a way that you still appreciate and wish them the best or pray for their success. It's, it's a tough place to be in, especially if you truly care about the people or the person that you want to be accepted and you want to be appreciated. And the thing is, that's how life is. It's either you stay there and get treated the way they are treating you or live your life away from that negativity. Every time I see those relatives of mine, I don't have any grudges. I would say hi. I actually hug them, even if they walk away even if they walk away from me. I'm okay with that. It's not about the pride. It's not about ego. It's about self-respect. If you keep trying to be accepted or be wanted by those people, not only are you just wasting your energy, but also it's worthless. I just wanted to share that with you guys because I've been through it. If you have any other questions or comments, comment down below and I'll see you in my next video.